friends welcome back to the another video of linux academy friends in the previous video we have learned the principles of the clamping and the need of clamping systems now in this video we are going to learn the different different types of the clamping devices used in machine shop used in jigs and fixtures so starting with the first one is nothing but the clamping screws very very simple clamping screws a screw clamps are a, one of the kind of the simplest and least expensive type of the clamps available in the market screw clamps offer the designer more clamping options than that of the different clamps you ha must have seen the variety of the clamps so these are the different different hand knobs you can see these are the hand knobs okay which is used in uh, different jigs and fixtures for the clamping this particular screw clamps makes an excellent work holders this clamping screws are the mechanical elements which uses the screw thrust for fixing and uh, bolting the work pieces so as we have seen this is a particular c type of the clamp this is a particular c type of the clamp okay this is a c type of the clamp which uses a screw for fixing of all the elements all the work pieces this is also a mechanical kind of a clamp which uses this set screws so that was nothing but the screw clamps moving ahead next is nothing but the hook bolt type clamp so over here you can see this is a very similarly look like a hook a stainless steel hook bolt is a specialized fastener which is known for its hook shaped end okay so this particular hook bolt is you know designed in such a way that it can uh, produce uh, some adjustable connections so over here at the bottom side this particular nut, nut is there which is used to adjust the position of the hook okay so you know it can form a you know a wide variety of the industrial and commercial applications and it can form a temporary kind of a uh, clamping system basically hook bolt for the quick clamping we can use this hook bolt clamp moving ahead next is nothing but the lever type clamp so over here this lever type clamps are uh, having diff two different types heel clamp or bridge type clamp basically friends this particular heel clamp it is suitable for the smaller work pieces over here nut is provided by adjusting the this particular nut you will be able to fix the work pieces into this uh, heel so that was the heel clamp bridge clamp over here is very very easy so work piece is supported over here a spring loaded nut is there at the bottom side and this particular over here nut is there a set screw and it forms a particular bridge over here this particular distance from this point and uh, this center is x and over here is y this particular nut the center line of the nut it is there in the middle okay in order to balance it so it is very simple and reliable clamping device the compressive force of the nut is shared between the workpiece and the clamp support so this particular workpiece and over here this is clamp support the compressive force will be acting from this particular point so these are nothing but the lever type clamps a very very simple type of the clamp over here friends you can see this is also a bridge type clamp but it is a cam operated over here here it is a cam Okay, which exerts a uh, you know force compressive force on this nut and then the workpiece gets clamped very very easily now friends uh, this uh, this type of the lever type clamps you can you see in a carpentry woodworking furniture making and welding kind of uh, you know applications moving ahead next is nothing but the swinging strap clamp now this type of the clamp can be rotated by 90 degrees to clear the passage for loading and unloading of the workpiece so this particular clamp okay swinging strap as the name itself says that it is a swinging type means if you adjust this nut it will go up and it will swing like this 
okay in both the directions so hence it is known as this a swinging type clamp over here this particular nut it is a spring loaded nut and workpiece it is uh, clamped from this particular portion so this is nothing but the swinging strap clamp this is also another example of the swinging strap clamp but over here this particular strap clamp over here this is a clamp you know it is a 45 degree adjustable so at 0 degree it is a clamped and after you know just tilting at 45 degrees it will unclamp the workpiece so it is a 45 degree swinging diagonal clamp developed for clamping the workpiece to the jig so this also comes in the category of swinging strap clamp moving ahead next is nothing but the hinge clamp so uh, you must have seen this particular hinges on the doors okay so hinge clamp it is a quick return kind of the clamps which is used in uh, jigs and fixtures this clamp provides a rapid clearance for the passage for loading and unloading of the workpiece so over here this is nothing but the hinged eye bolt is provided okay it is also a swinging type okay and a strap is also of a swinging type which is provided here <clears throat> this clamp has an open slot through which the eye bolt can be swung into position so over here from the top view over here it is a slot is there okay so while clamping the strap goes down and this hinged eye bolt goes inside that uh, open slot and then the tightening can be done by this hexagonal bolt so it is a very simple kind of uh, the clamp that is used uh, for this uh, you know rapid movement quick loading and unloading of the workpiece so this particular hinge clamp can be of the box type as shown over here this is a box type kind of a, and this is for the circular workpieces so mainly this particular uh, uh, hinge clamp it is having a hinges over here in this particular point a wing nut shown over here and this type of the clamp is mainly useful in the pharmaceutical industries for uh, you know for different different connections such as autoclave connections so this hinge clamp so moving ahead next is nothing but the quick acting clamps now friends we have a three different categories for quick acting clamps that is nothing but the C clamp as we have seen earlier C clamp is there quick that is nothing but the C clamp quick acting not cam operated clamps so first is nothing but the C clamps very simple having a set of uh, you know screws is there sometimes which uh, we can call it as a G clamps also so these are used to hold the work materials in place usually wood or metal usually wood or metal so these clamps are used in many industries such as the carpentry, welding, automotive. So this is this is nothing but the very very basic kind of the clamp, C clamp. Moving ahead is nothing but the quick action nut. As the name itself says that it is a quick action hand nut. So it is having a threading inside. As you can say, see over here, this particular nut is having a threading but the threading is in a such a way that it is not fully so this particular quick acting knurl nodes are mainly used in applications where no high clamping pressures are required okay tilt the nut to slide to on and then straighten it to engage to the threads tilt the nut to slide on and then straighten it to engage to the threads so that's why it is known as a quick acting nut over here the threading is there but threading it is not fully threading it is into a tapered direction for quick release of this nut so while opening you don't need to you know uh, rotate it fully you just need to slide it down and the nut will come out so this is nothing but a tilt acting nut or or we can call it as a quick action hand nut the material is the high carbon steel or the stainless steel 
and the last one is nothing but the cam operated clamp over here friends this is nothing but the cam which is provided basically friends in engineering cam is a mechanical joint or mechanical linkage that converts the rotational moment into the linear moment as you can see over here this particular rotational moment of the shaft gets converted into the linear moment of these walls so these particular walls so this arrangement you can see in the cam shafts okay which is used in the engine blocks so basically friends cam is a rotating or sliding piece in a mechanical linkage used especially in transforming rotary motion into linear motion so this particular cam can be used while clamping the workpiece so over here you can see this is a bridge clamp okay and on the top of the bridge clamp the force is exerted by the cam for clamping the workpiece and the last one is nothing but the toggle clamp very very easy this particular toggle clamps are a quick uh, release kind of a clamps so a quick acting kind of a clamp so over here this toggle clamp you must have seen in various industries so friends that was all about the different different clamping devices used in machine shop i hope you like my video if you having any queries any doubts feel free to comment and please do subscribe to my educational channel engineers academy so this is narendra buktar signing off Thank you so much.